Welcome back to Etymology Vitamins with Brother Jamal. Today's word is fetch. Fetch comes from the Indo-European root ped, P-E-D. Simply, it means foot. Now, the actual description for this word is quite vast. The entry um, in this book is vast, but simply put, ped means foot. Now, let's put on our symbolic hats though, and let's consider what that really means. Fetch means foot? Hmm, typically when you think of fetching something, you want to you're talking about grabbing something, grasping something. What does it have to do with a foot? Well, the foot stands under your body. So your foot is understanding. If you understand something, you grasp it i.e. fetch. There's a peculiar character that I'm sure many of you are familiar with. His real name is Lincoln Perry, but he performed under the moniker of Steppin' Fetchin'. A very polarizing character in black history. Some say he was a buffoon who set black people back with his antics and shucking and jiving. Some say he was a genius who demonstrated the the tool of pretending to be dumb to placate the egos of Jim Crow quote-unquote white supremacist. That's going to be left up to debate. But one thing is for sure the name Fetchin is more than what we think, or more than what it may appear at first glance. Yes, fetch does tie back to the foot, and the foot representing understanding, but it goes even deeper. Fetchum, and its Arabic root of F-H-M, ties back to an ancient Masonic group called the Perceivers. And this Masonic group is not masonry in what we think it is today or what it is perceived to be or represented as today. This is a Sufi order called the Perceivers. The Fetchum, also referred to as the Carbonari, root of Carbonari, carbon. Was Stepin Fetchin really what we thought he was, or we believe to represent? Or is it something way deeper? Hey, this has been another episode of Etymology Vitamins with Brother Jamal, mastersofthecosmos.com. As always, stay down until you get up. And when you get up, stay down.